Hello everybody. Today uh, we're going to discuss about uh, electric hydraulic steric pump. This one uh, is for Citroen Saxo 2001 model. As you see it's already disassembled. It has two main components. This is the uh, motor that gives uh, that spins the pump here it goes like this and the electric motor gives a spin to the pump and then the pump compresses the hydraulic fuel and injects it from here to the steering wheel okay Regarding the electric motor, there is not uh, a lot of things to say. Uh, if it's damaged, it's damaged then it can uh, be used. Or uh, the main problem that occurs is that uh, after years, the inside uh, plates must be replaced. And uh, again, the motor uh, should work very, very well. Okay, so leave it here and this is the hydraulic pump you see this is uh, the cap that uh, holds the hydraulic fuel it's a little old okay and so this is the hydraulic pump Here it spins from or take spin from the electric motor. And here is where the, it injects uh, under pressure the hydraulic fuel to the steering wheel. So as we open the cup, you see a small uh, area here which uh, is uh, a place where the hydraulic fuel gets all the pressure and then uh, and this hole here goes through this one and goes outside here this is a regulation a pressure regulation valve uh, it can be uh, we will see after it can be arranged from here adjust uh, from here okay we will take out this cap here So here we see it uh, takes all the uh, hydraulic fuel that is in the cup. It takes it from here and takes it uh, upstairs, from downstairs to upstairs in this chain. All those parts are from aluminium. You can see inside how it is. And here you can see the whole mechanism of the hydraulic pump. The flu the hydraulic fuel is taken in inside. It, uh, inverse, uh, I'm sorry, inverse. Take it from outside, from this small area to this small back area, and then afterwards through here the chain as we saw here and then back through this hole down there and outside 
and this is as I said the uh, adjustable uh, pressure valve that controls how much pressure after how much pressure uh, this will open and uh, th throws the hydraulic fuel uh, again inside the whole cup it can be regulated uh, with uh, I use an H6 from KS tools from here and you can adjust it uh, or take it out if you want I can show you how you have to uh, tighten it here so that it cannot spin and then Okay, it's done. Inside you will see how it works. I have to take it off. Okay, let's see how we're gonna do it rapidly. Not to push it on. Okay, this is uh, the uh, spring that uh, after a pressure it uh, opens uh, a gate and through this hole here, you see it has a hole here. You see it? Through this hole inside again to the chamber. and also has two, three, four holes okay again be aligned change it a little bit That's about it now it's more aligned with the hole there. That was it. Okay, very good aligned. We're good to go. Now this bar 
good have this ring make sure if it's uh, not well you have to be replaced it has to be replaced okay this one has to be screwed very tight because uh, you have a lot of pressure inside here okay we will use this one after if you have uh, a specific key with uh, those gaps you can put it uh, we can screw it with uh, that uh, it will be better okay after that we will put again the cap and now as you see it's assembled not quite exactly we have to put those ones but i'll do it later so that was all folks that was a hydraulic uh, 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 electric hydraulic uh, pump for steering wheel uh especially for this one is for Peugeot and Citroen this one was was from uh, Citroen Saxo thank you very much for watching